I'm so, so excited. Go 2020 is coming up, starts the 1st of May, right through to the 31st of May. And our dream and our vision is to join with Christians around the world, 100 million Christians at least, who will share their testimony of salvation with five of their friends and pray for those five friends and pray for many others to find Jesus Christ. Can you imagine the effect of that, the multiplication effect of that? The only way it's going to really happen is through prayer. So this coming Friday, starting at 6 p.m., we're going to have 24 hours of prayer and worship to God as we pray for release of God's blessing on Go 2020 around the world. This is an amazing move of God and the Camera Declaration has signed up to be part of this and to get behind it and really support it. We'll be having a devotional each day coming out, a prayer devotional, and please sign up for that to receive that right through May, from the 1st right through to the uh, 31st. And we'll also be having every night at 8 p.m. we'll be praying. So please join us in those nights right through May. Yes, sign up for the devotional. There's a link under the uh, in the newsletter or under this um, YouTube. But we encourage you to join us to kick this thing off with a bang. That's 24 hours of prayer, praise and worship. Jesse Skelly is going to lead it. But first of all, let me just show you two of these amazing 60 second hope stories to encourage you. My name's Joseph Byro and this is my hope story. Everyone's got hopes and dreams to be somebody, to be someone special, to be appreciated and wanted and loved. When I was 21, I got signed to Melbourne Rock Outfit, Super Heist. This was my dream, to be a front man, to be a rock star. Little did I know it would plummet me into a life of debauchery, drugs, alcohol, sex, and partying. Um, that led me to 11 year meth addiction, ice addiction. I then began injecting ice, for nine years I injected ice. I became crazy, I became angry, I became um, a criminal. I was so bad that my family threw me out in the streets and got an IVO against me. For two years I lived on the streets um, and I basically was at the lowest point of my life. I cried out to God, he led me to a rehab. Just before I took my lot, wanted to take my own life. I encountered God, I encountered his goodness. I'm now a minister of the gospel and I love Jesus so much more than anything. I'm just about to have my first baby. There's hope for anyone. I'm Joseph Borrow. This is my hope story. G'day Facebook. My name's Luke Bowler and I just thought I'd jump on here and share a bit of my testimony and what Jesus has done in my life. So for 11 years, I was a drug addict alcoholic. Um, over those years, I struggled with depression, um, anxiety, low self-worth, low self-esteem. I couldn't keep a job, I went from place to place and city to city just chasing my fix and chasing the party. I was always on the run from the cops, um, I was just lost. Um, I ended up in prison four times and prison became normal for me. Um, thank God that my last night in prison I met Jesus. Um, since walking with the Lord um, I no longer struggle with depression, anxiety, low self-worth. I'm coming up six years clean and sober. Um, I have a purpose. I know I'm loved. Um, I've got a beautiful wife and two kids. Um, the Lord's blessed us with our own business and our own home. Um, if this has hit any one of you and you're struggling or you need help, just reach out. I'd love to speak with you and share with you and walk with you. Hallelujah. Aren't they absolutely fantastic? Those videos... Can you imagine those videos going right across this nation and right across the earth as people send them to each other and other people do them, then other people do them. And before you know it, we've got perhaps millions upon millions of people sharing a hope story for 60 seconds. So that's what we'll be praying for and other things as well. And so God bless you. Thank you for your support. Get together with us this coming Friday night, 6 p.m. Come for an hour, come for three hours, right through to 6 p.m on Saturday. God bless you.